feel? What do you feel like you guys are right now? It's a really good team. Just got to fight. I mean, 2018, we started out 1-5. And, five, and uh, that's why we have these guys in this room. Uh, a lot of teams may not, may not be able to come back from this, but I think we are. So uh, we're going to look ourselves in the mirror. And, uh, yeah, we're 0-3, but our owner said the best thing he could have said. We're 0-3, but this week we, we're 0-0. And, and our focus is on the Dolphins. So uh, we're going to you know, look at the film coming on Monday, bust our bus on Wednesday, and try to set the tone to win this game next week. I mean, you guys are a good team. This why does it feel like you guys keep making the plays that bad teams make? Does it feel like that? It's not. I, yeah, I mean, really, this is execution. Even offensively, red zone, we, we got to execute. Uh, Frank calls, you know, Frank calls what he calls. And uh, as offense, no matter what he calls, we have to execute. That's on starting with everybody, you know, the offensive line, QBs, running backs, receiver. We got to execute. And uh, I think, uh, you know, we play a great game for the most part, but in the situational ball, we just have to execute better, and uh, we're going to work our butts off to do that. What did you observe from uh, Carson today in the circumstances? He's tough as nails. Played a great game. Uh, we did all we could do to protect him. Uh, you know, we had some big plays here and there, but, uh, you know, we just got to make the plays. Uh, we got to take the gimme plays, and sometimes you got to go out there and take a little something out of nothing, and uh, that's what good teams do. So uh, we ain't do enough of that today, and we got to just keep going forward. Why do you think you provide some of those big plays? You get the ball in space, do you feel like you can get the ball more? I know it seems like after two touches last week, we see what we have today, it'll be like this every single week. <laughs> uh you know, hopefully it's like that every single week. Uh, I'm not a coach. I don't call the plays. But uh, I know uh, when I get out in space, I know I can do everything in my power to, you know, help our team get better. And uh, that's what I try to do every time. At the same time, year four, you're a leader. Are you comfortable going coach right at this point and saying, hey, I'm ready to carry more of this load than I am? <laughs> uh, no, that's not, that's not really me. I, I, I won't do that. Uh, I trust – Coach Reich, he trusts me. He knows what I'm capable of. He knows what he knows. He, he's a play caller, so he knows what every person's capable of. He knows what I can do in space. He knows what JT can do, and he knows all of our strengths and weaknesses. So uh, I know, you know, Frank's going to get everything together. He'll have a great game plan like he did this weekend. We're going to go out there and attack Miami next week. Why do you think you guys got away from the run? I don't know. I think probably it was a little bit of scheme. Uh, I think it was a little bit of their scheme, too. You know, we obviously uh, we have plays where we can kill it. And, uh, you know, we had run. There were times when I was in it, we had runs on, and we had a certain look, and we changed the play to a pass. It's the defense, the scheme. So uh, we had runs that were game plan, but sometimes it doesn't work out like that. Did you feel like the Titans were kind of daring you guys to pass by stacking? Uh, no, it's a divisional game. I think, truthfully, just the, the Titans did some things that they haven't shown on film. They did a couple of things that we haven't seen on film, so we were making adjustments on the fly. And a great game great, great game plan by them. They know what we do. We know what they do. So uh, they had some new wrinkles in. It might have uh, got us on a couple plays. But uh, I think, really, it's just execution. Are guys more stunned in the locker room that you're all three, or are they pissed off? Or they, what's the... I don't know. I'm, I'm pissed off. I'm, I'm, I'm angry and I'm upset. upset. I'm ready to go on Wednesday and work my butt off and uh, set the tone for this week. And uh, a lot of guys, we know that we let some games get away and we got to execute better in the red zone. I don't, I don't know. We scored what one touchdown at a what were we one for five, one for four. That's four for, four for twelve in a year. That's unacceptable. We got to be better. And uh, as players, we got to execute. So uh, I know one thing is that red zone. Like I like I don't know what else we take from the game, but as me as a player speaking, just. Uh, I know as an offensive player, the red zone, we have to be better. And even that, that, the defense can do what they can do, but when we're kicking field goals and not scoring touchdowns, that's, we have to be better, and we will be. Does it frustrate you more that you got into those opportunities and then didn't convert as opposed to just like not even getting down to the red area? <sighs> Uh, I mean, honestly, like uh, what we what we're taking from it is uh, it's, I think what we're taking from it is each week we are getting better. And uh, we're trending upwards. Uh, I think this week was better than last week. And uh, that's what we're going to focus on as an offense. Uh, we're going to keep doing that. And I know for sure that we are getting better. We're getting down there more. Um, and really even kicking more field goals. So we really just have to go score. And uh, we will, I promise you guys, we are going to do everything in our power to do that.